Now, friends become enemies. They are frenemies as we start the day here at Chengdu. Our fourth stop of 2024. The stop, no pop, but Baraj didn't forget to tip. Crossovers, you left something. Wilson on the way off the iron. Baraj will snag the rebound. Then Diesel hands it off to Robot. Stefan going to work. Stoichis turns the corner. Nearly got it swatted. Baraj is there and he is fouled. So, the Diesel is hitting on all cylinders. And I think for the first time this year, we can see his chin. He came freshly shaven to this Chengdu Masters. A new look for Nim Diesel. <laughs> he misses the free throw. That's the only thing he's done poorly this year. Shooting up around 50% from the line. But again, Nemanja Badaj is Oob's leading score in 2024. The Beast, he has been offline this year for long range. Badaj will snag yet another rebound. Not shooting a free throw this time. Instead, possession goes to U. Maistorovic is back for the first time since Utsunomiya, and he's doing what he does. All around the world, the same song is string music to give Uv a 3-0 lead. Maistorovic again won here in Chengdu in 2018, or 19 rather, with his coach now, Marco Chidero. Domo Ivo Sethen, the great, maybe one of the most underrated players ever, Marco Savage. And he's looking for title number two. Maistorovic bumped out of bounds. Maestro will get a rest. Mim Diesel is in. So as Ube have changed their roster a good bit this year, just rotating players. Still trying to find the chemistry. Robot from the logo to the beast. Rakovic just needs to see one go through. But they need to put a warrant out for his shot. He has been missing this year. Rakovic, not to harp on the beast, but Rakovic this year, 7 of 34 from D. Meantime, it's Kristaps Chabars, the 22-year-old. He earns the foul and a trip to the strike. Will knock it down. Thing with Adazi is they've they've shown some signs of greatness. There's greatness for you, a living legend. Maistorovic makes it 4-2. Up top, Adazi goes. Ooh, nice, tricky dribble. Got a foul off the ball. Take another look at Maistorovic, 36 years old, in his 11th season still with a nice first step. Crossover. He's got Robot on his back. He does not have the Wilson anymore. That belongs to Oob, or, or so it did. But wait a minute, they changed possessions. And Adazi did not clear it. So, no bucket for them. Possession over to Oob. As Stoichich will get things started. Check ball, and it's back on. 4-2. Game one of day one. Stoichich. Beast, up bank, drives, slides in. So Oob doing a good job maintaining an early lead, but for how long? That shot off the back heel. Stoichich will get it cleared. Got an offensive foul called on Brankovic. So each team now with four fouls. Here's a look at the Beast. Again, he's struggled from two lands, so why not? Take advantage of an open lane. Hezzy 
Floating, no good. But Osis has the right idea. He will attack, but ain't a whole lot he can do with the muscle-bound man known as Nim Diesel. Now Barac in hot pursuit. Look at that defense. Definitely a hack there on the shot attempt. One will put Edmonds Elksnis on the line. He's the eldest member of this Adazi team. Elksnis at 33 years old. Does not have much 3x3 experience. He will knock in the free throw. 6-3, Maestro step back. Oh, could not convert the play. That was gonna be a highlight for sure. Oh yeah, foul on the floor. Malkovich wanted to travel, but let's be honest, the man got pushed in the back. So we headed to our first media timeout. Again, we are in Chengdu for the fifth time. Lehman won in Chengdu last year. Novi side in 19. Lehman in 18. And Piran back in 17. I was, I was on the mic back then. We went to the Panda Zoo here. It was an incredible experience. I think I'm going to try to go back this time. This is the land of the panda. <laughs> Seven minutes to go, and we are back underway. Let's get to it, shall we? Here we go. Pull up. Two range. Nope, came up abbreviated. Stefan clearing out some space, and Uber done a great job isolating the interior defender, uh, particularly whoever's been matched up against Barach. And they've got Adazi up to five fouls now. Barach will start from the elbow. He's got Stoich is coming around. He cannot knock down the two-pointer. Out of bounds it will go. So the two-point shooting for Ube has been less than desirable, if you dig what I'm saying. They've been 29% from two range so far in 2024, which isn't the worst percentage, but usually they're into the 30s. And the only two they have in this one is courtesy of Mike Stortovich. Look at this defense. He shut him down, down, down. Badaj inside. Easy work. Oh, quick move. That's a nice attack from Osis. Badaj continuing to go to work, but wait a second, he's called for the travel. Even the baby face won't sell the call to Guy and Kim. And nobody home. Miscommunication from Adazi. Still very much in this game. Make no mistake about it. Just a three-point contest here. But if you watch Dube at, at any point, they're usually a lot better in the second five minutes than they are in the first five minutes. Badac down to the basement. Badac sticks with it. It's 8-4 as a result. And an offensive foul. That one's called. That one called on uh, Kristaps Chabars moving on that screen. Another look at the beast inside Brankovic. Last year, who averaged over five points per game, has struggled some with his offense this year. But I think scoring inside and distributing the ball is going to be his key to get back in his groove. But. The Beast will get a rest. Stoichich is back in. Running hook to Scrum. Barac swings it. Robot thought about the two. Instead, he'll drive, swings it over to Maestro. He readjusts and finds his way to the rim and in. Five-point lead. Give me those. Thank you very much. I think they say Quara in Serbian. 
nine, four, two is on the way, and looks like Mysorovic is down. That is the seventh foul now on Adazi. That means that Mystorovic will be shooting two free throws. Dayan Mystorovic. He's won the most world titles, the most world tour finals, the most European titles. He's the game's all time leading scorer and still looking for more. An Olympic bronze medalist. Although they have not named their Olympic team for 2024, Serbia has not. I would expect him to be on that roster. You want to talk about a, a decorated career. He will splash that one. I actually uh, did a little survey on my Instagram, at 3x3, the voice, uh, last week. And I asked, who's the greatest of all time? Who's the most clutch shooter? And who's the most underrated player? And I gotta tell you, the voting for the greatest of all time was neck and neck between Mai Sotovich and Dusan Pulin. And also, Mai Sotovich was the leader in the clutchest shot maker in history in my little personal survey. Norris Miezis was, uh, I think, just two votes behind. And uh, most underrated was tough. It was between Agnes Chavars, uh, host, uh, Stefan Koyic, uh, Vasic, several of those players. Barac, running hook, no good. The debate will continue. The debate will continue. I can guarantee you that. Oh, what a save. Beautiful save and a better finish. Awesome play. Turns into a bucket. 11-5, though, as Adazi's offense has been slow coming, but they're looking for more now. Hop step, oh, excuse me. Oh, we get through uh, like rush hour. Robert Smilgis. Stojicic, oh, halfway yeah. down, comes out. Barac yeah. with a man on his Hold back. Right. He couldn't even feel him. Oh, Doesn't move. But look at this, look at this. Top step. Beautiful play. There's Badac. What a year he's having. You're looking at the top two point shooter in 3x3, by the way. Badac, 47% from two range. He's also converted 82% of his one point attempts and leads the team in scoring at six points per game with four rebounds and a league best five blocks he is filling up the stat sheet and continues to lead Ooh, seven point lead is adazi's offense is on pause maestro runs into trouble gives it up to the beast ronquilla oh what a dish Served up hot and fresh to the maestro. Behind the pen of the defender and Bucket given up on the inside. Ooh, just want the Wilson. Brokovic to Maestro. Oh, perfection. Perfection. Eight point lead. Roberts. Oh, it's Roberts. Oh, pulls up and hits the lefty stroke from 15 foot out. That'll be the ninth foul on Adazi. That's not good news for them. They're already in trouble. So the media timeout will get both teams a little rest. But for Oob, I don't know if. They're a victim of lofty expectations because of all the success that they've had. Or because it's not like they're having a bad year. They lost in Utsunomiya in the final. And then the previous two tournaments, losing in the quarterfinals, they lost to the eventual champions. So lost to Radon Virus and then Amsterdam, who went on to win uh, both of those masters. So uh, that's in Marseille and Ulamatar. So, and close games. 
These were not blowout wins, so they've been right there, just have not been able to capture their first event win. 17-8. They are going to capture a win to start the day, though. And that's exactly how they want to open things up. 314 to play in this one. And I'm not certain it's going to go the distance. Adazi with nine fouls. A tenth will put them in the double penalty. And I don't think Uv is going to be letting up the pressure at any time soon. They'll get it to the maestro right elbow. They'll give it over to Stojicic. These two used to go at each other's neck when Stojicic was with Lehman. Oh, now he's taking Rupa. people to spin class. He's the instructor. Maestro, quickly down to Badac, the extra pass. Oh, too much from Stojicic, who has also struggled with his two-point shooting. No such issues for Elksnes. He finds the bottom of the net. That's going to be a foul. And... Take a look at the step back. In the double penalty, so it's now Smooth sequence, but they do Uwe. foul after that, and that ain't good because that's going to put Mike Stortovich on the line. And you know what he does at the free throw strike. You might as well count that. First free throw. Yeah. Cash. No such thing as an announcer's jinx with Mike Stortovich on the line. One more will give his team game point. They get possession after this by virtue of the double penalty. Second free throw. Second one, same story. Point game for Team Ulvis. The Maestro handles business at the charity strike. Point game. 237 and counting. Maestorovic, wide open to the beast. Extra pass, same spot, different result. This time, Robot connects. He lifts his hands in the air triumphantly as he finally sees one go down. It is a runaway win for the Serbians. Uvwishan in They handle Adazi easily. Twenty two to ten.